The function of an ele- forward to boil water, but it's a crowded market, and the right model for one person might not be right for another. If you're a poor over coffee diehard, a gooseneck is non negotiable. More on that below. If you prefer French press, the type of spout doesn't matter so much. If tea is your beverage of choice, you already know that the brew temperature for a green tea differs significantly from that of a black tea, and you probably want a kettle that can dial in on, that can dial in on that range. I naively disregarded this until I got a temperature controlled one of my own. And while coffee and tea are the two main reasons people keep an electric kettle on their counters, maybe you just love instant noodles and want a quick and reliable boil when you're hungry for dinner. No matter your situation, there's a right kettle out there for you, and I talked to a slew of experts to figure out the best of the bunch. Use the links below to navigate to the type of electric kettle that you're looking for, and check out our full criteria here. Whether you're looking to be cold with a hot cuppa or you like to sip warm beverages year-round, electric kettles are a quick, efficient way to heat water without a stove. With most models offering variable heat settings, they're the best way to get precise brews on pour-over coffees and specialty teas. To find the best electric kettles, we spent this early winter making ourselves countless cups of tea and pour over coffee, and in the end we found four great electric kettles to help you brew the to help you brew the perfect cup, whatever your taste and budget. Number 3, XD Buono Power Kettle. Power Kettle. Hario was the arist type of spout, and though more advanced gooseneck kettles have since come out, it still commands a lot of respect. Cited by several of our pros as a solid choice, Suyog Modi, co-founder of Brooklyn's Driftaway Coffee, has had his for about 8 years, and if you're looking to get a temperature that will work for coffee, you don't have to overthink it. Just boil the water, wait a minute, and then pour it, he instructs, James McCarthy, Modi's colleague, Modi's colleague and coffee educator at Driftaway, is also a fan. I like the feel of it, it's easy to handle. While none of the professionals I talked to called out the look of the Hario in particular, I think it's quite attractive. Leah Muncy, my colleague and an avid tea drinker, owns one and agrees wholeheartedly. I mean, just look at that little wavy handle. She says, sometimes I just stare at it. Number 2, double temperature electric kettle. Electric kettle. If you don't particularly mind, several experts mentioned the Bonavita electric kettle as being just as operationally and technically impressive as the Stag EKG. It does all the same things, it's just less form focused, says Ramage, but it's also less expensive. Indeed, you'll save $59 if you go this route without giving up the temperature precision and hold. Ken Nye, owner of 9th Street Espresso, likes that the controls are simple and intuitive, are simple and, intuitive and even thinks the Bonavita has a slight edge over the Stag EKG beyond the lower price. The larger capacity and faster flow rate are both helpful when using the kettle for things other than pour over coffee, he says. Number 1, KG Electric Kettle. Electric Kettle. The fellow stag, without question, the gold standard of electric kettles. It's been a strategist favorite since it came out several years ago and has held that regard since, through multiple updates to our best gifts for tea lovers and coffee lovers roundups and yet again when I set out to consult the experts for this piece. With the exception of two people, everybody told me the stag EKG is the best of the best. One simply didn't mention it, and the other said he appreciates a lot about it but prefer lot about it but prefers the way other kettles feel in his hand. The Stag EKG is more expensive than most on this list, but not so much more expensive that the price lessened its ranking. There's just too much praise surrounding it. It heats quickly and allows you to adjust the temperature setting in one degree increments, explains Jared Morrison, co-founder and co-CEO of Sight Glass Coffee in San Francisco. It will even regulate and hold at your temp preference, which is super useful and convenient. Marco Suarez, one of the owners of Methodical Coffee in Greenville, South Carolina, mentions that it turns itself off as a safety feature after it's been left sitting for longer than an hour. I've had mine for maybe five years, and it's still in great shape, he says. Many called out its precise pouring ability thanks to the gooseneck spout. Granted, a feature found in multiple models on this list, and everyone noted that it's the most attractive of the bunch. For an object you're going to have sitting on your countertop day in and day out, there is no one else that really touches fellow in terms of looks, says Suarez.